to try my absolute hardest to get him off of me. And I couldn't do it, obviously. And he said something to make the point that he was so much stronger than me that I wouldn't be able to fight him back. Fight back against what? What do you mean? You are officially banned from the tri-state area DMV. DC, you're not allowed to be in Maryland. You're not allowed to be in Virginia. You have officially been declared barred on all three states. You want to go around the city biting people like a dog? We will put you down like one. Run that back. To talk about the Wilbur Soot allegations. If you guys are not aware with If he plays Minecraft, he did it. He played Minecraft, he did it. If he has a big YouTube Minecraft channel, he did that. SMP, you might know him from his music, or you just might know him from other things. Now, oh, so just run it back. No, no. Actually, how these allegations came out in the first place was around four days ago, a YouTuber and Twitch streamer who goes by the name of Shubble did a live stream about the alleged abuse. Wow. Let's Killer take a look at this video. X100. Love you, Johnny boy. Ah, uh, thank you, bro. Shout out, shout out, Killer, man. Let's take a look at this guy's music. We can see what, what this guy's cooking by his music. Let's take a look. YouTube. Oh, no, no. The brother's making YouTube videos about Minecraft, going around the city, calling himself soft boy, and wearing a hentai hoodie. Whatever these allegations are, Zalog did. Hentai merch is crazy. Hell no. I'm living the dream. It's just one of those dreams where you're losing all your team. And if you think that it gets better. Uh, he had this habit of biting, which is so weird to me uh... now. But he said that he had had this habit since he was a kid. And even his mom said that that was true. And he said it was just affectionate and that that might have been now they got i mean i think that that might have been true people? maybe at the start but i also feel that i have good reason to believe that every part of it was a lie but that's just my personal opinion um and i had no problem with just biting that isn't even the most uncommon thing um but he did mention something early that i should have taken as a red flag um, and he wanted to make sure that I was okay with him biting me because he didn't want me to come back later and say that he abused me. <laughs> nah, bro. This dude is getting too excited for the new Walking Dead series. Carrao, man. This dude get fear the Walking Dead. Fear Wilbur Scoot, man. This guy watches Walking Dead one time. Guys, Dua Lipa. I'm trying to do a move. Does she look like Dua Lipa? Damn. You might have cracked the car when you cracked the So why? Wait, wait, Wilbur Scoot, you gotta see me. Boom, boom. Hold on, wait. Antonio Banderas? Wait, okay, the fragrance is kicking in. Go, 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 go. Sweet, oh, shit. checking on me to make sure that I was still comfortable. Um, she did but not I, of look course like I was Lipa. because he hadn't hurt me. And why would I think he ever would? Yo, yeah, bite, biting is crazy. She was fine with it. Like not even on no freaky, like you know, you know, no freaky biting, just like straight up, like you know, biting the brother's like forearms or something. That's crazy. Can we talk about the gameplay? This is fucking ass. <laughs> this guy sucks at Mario. Get, can we get someone else to play this game? Man? And if he had consent to do it or not? How do you suck he at? He started Mar biting me more and more over a period of time, sort of throughout the whole relationship, and accidents of him biting too hard and really hurting me happened more and more frequently um no but he always seemed genuinely sorry and he decided that he didn't want to keep accidentally hurting me um so we were going to use a safe word um so he could learn where my limit was where my pain tolerance ended uh and saying that out loud now doesn't sound yeah, somebody get this guy a muzzle. Like that's not very sound logic. Luis um, Suarez over here. But at the time, I thought he cared about not hurting me. But in reality, it's like, why are you biting so hard? And why do you have to bite so hard? And it shouldn't be that hard of a problem to stop. Um, that shouldn't be that hard. And he disguised it as this really quirky part of our relationship and was so comfortable sharing it with his friends to the point that he would do it in front of them. He thought it was this really funny story to tell and a good bit to take my arm and bite me in front <laughs> no, of him. No, he said, he said, what was that? I'm a freak, just let me know. <laughs> no, no. Until I literally shout in pain. Um, oh, and then no. I have to laugh it off because I'm so embarrassed and I don't want to cause a scene in front of all of our friends. And I'm sure everyone was a little bit uncomfortable, but as long as I was people? saying that it was fine, in front of the city? Nobody really felt like they needed to be concerned, and that's not anybody's fault, because I was lying. <laughs> I was lying, and it wasn't fine, because I would go home later, 
And I tell him how uncomfortable I was, how much I didn't like being hurt all the time. And I needed him to really stop biting so hard. I didn't like it. And I tried telling him over and over again because he wasn't actually trying at all to not hurt me. Now, I'm not going to sit here and say this Damn. is abuse or this isn't abuse because I just do not know. I'm not a qualified professional. But regardless of what it is, it's really fucking weird. Once again, people are into their own things, their own nasty things. And I usually don't have a problem with people being into their little nasty things like that, as long as it's not illegal. But like genuinely, this one is really weird. Now, when it comes down to you not liking something that he's doing, and you make that apparently clear to him that you don't want him doing this specific thing to you, and he keeps going ahead and doing it that's just very fucking wrong but in this case so far what sure. i am seeing is you just didn't want him to do it that hard which if you didn't want him to do it that hard you know the situation is bad do it that hard. Is, is it this, definitely is pushing the is this a, the whole situation is this it for 17 minutes is he gonna talk about how this dude is biting girls and shit like a dog dream and who knows they could be like around this. people Fuck and no. i can look back now and i can see all these instances the guy, that the guy, were really Put him major down, red flags um there was this one time that he pinned me down and asked me to try my absolute hardest to get him off of me. And I couldn't do it, obviously. And he said something to make the point that he was so much stronger than me that I wouldn't be able to fight him back. Fight back against what? What do you mean? You what? don't say shit like that? This is the work of the best, yeah, man. Go on you. Go on you. Wilbur, you are officially banned from the tri-state area DMV. If I, you are you are no longer allowed on DC. You're not allowed to be in Maryland. You're not allowed to be in Virginia. You have officially been declared barred on all three states. If we catch you in any part of the city, bro, we hunting you down like a dog. You want to act? You want to go around the city biting people like a dog? We gonna put you down like one. This guy, man, what's up with these twinks getting out of hand, insane. man? That's um, insane. Let me speak to the people. <laughs> like, good dog to him. And I was also sexually assaulted by my first boyfriend, and he knew that. Yeah, no, this guy seems like a really shitty person, honestly. I'm not really too sure about the abuse allegations, but yeah, he, he really seems like a shitty person. I'm not even lying here. Like, I just can't wrap my head around why you would say that to somebody. Like, I'm not sure if he thought that he had more power over her, and she really couldn't do anything about it, and that's what he was... I'm, I'm looking at the guy. I mean, I, I don't know how much more power, but it's not by a great margin. Friends, I'm looking at the brother right here. You know, he's he's looking like he's made of clay. All right. So he's going around talking about something. I have more power this than the third. My brother. Not that much. Not that much. I tell you that are the parts where she talks about how he really didn't pick up after himself or really take care of himself. Like at times she was saying that he would spill something and then he would just never clean it up. There was an ant infestation. There was black mold and other things. <laughs> I, like it's just crazy what you can see that. if you're behind that. the scenes and you see the person for who they are and not who they are behind the camera. Like I'll be honest, he did not look too black bad mold. behind Resident the camera, Evil 7 mentioned somebody who knew him personally mold. in their perspective. So this was posted yesterday on February 27th, 2024. He goes on to say, in the past week, a series of allegations have been made over my conduct from an ex-girlfriend. I want to empathize that although I feel it fair to offer my perspective, this person's feelings are completely valid. I have taken my time sharing this statement as I wanted to process and respond respectfully and with the hope to gain a deeper understanding for the situation. During our relationship's final months, I regrettably became slobbish, disrespectful, and selfish. These actions caused a lot of pain to my ex-girlfriend and I've sought therapy to address Holy these behaviors shit. making significant lifestyle change yo venus you're bro I, I knew i wasn't tweaking bro this that this first this this introduction paragraph is fucking just words it, it's not even c coherent for me at least i don't think it's just like a bunch of words what the fuck man it's just bro, to just rectify to the my past actions. I have come to realize how much my behavior hurt this person. Fucking but straight, I truly, pure malarkey. believe I have made great strides <clears throat> from the person I once was. And so I can continue to grow and improve on this trajectory. The allegations of abuse, particularly in the form of biting, deeply shocked me. Throughout our relationship, I understood from our numerous conversations and text message exchanges on the subject that this behavior was consensual, playful, and reciprocally enjoyed. I truly believe those personal message exchanges reflect mutual affection and understanding. Out of respect for her, I chose to not publish them, and I emphasize my perspective is not shared to diminish or invalidate anyone's feelings. Instead, I share it in the hope that I can offer a genuine, fair, and relevant insight into my understanding of the situation. While I may perceive our interactions differently, I recognize that this person has processed and expressed feelings of hurt. I want to extend my sincerest apologies for any pain that I caused. I am fully committed to understanding and addressing her concerns going forward. I hope my perspective sheds light on the situation without detracting from its message. I am dedicated- Oh my god, bro. Man! Just say, I got a little, I got a little too freaky. I'm a freak. Let me know. That's my bad. I apologize. Man, just say, yo, bro, I did that shit. I got a little too freaky in the city. 
That, that, that's my bad. Bro, Lockie and Thomas, I'm, I'm fully committed to understanding and addressing your concerns going forward. Shut your ass up, dude! Man! To earning and maintaining Shut that malarkey the up, gotta. I also think it would be good if he could maybe show this evidence Yo, that, why is you know, Peach fat? What the fuck? Instead of just saying that- I was informed about this like a few minutes before going live, so forgive me if I don't have my thoughts 100% clear in my head, but I read through it and like, bro, I, 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 I made me so angry. It may, I actually couldn't fucking believe it. Like, I didn't, I didn't, I'm like- <laughs> It seems like you could believe it. It seems like it, bro. Bro, just bullshit. I know about. I'm a. I'm a special grade bullshitter. This guy. This guy is all par. This guy is all par. Holy shit. Yeah. I. I'm. I'm. I'm not biased in this. I think that response was, fucking vile. I'm like, how the hell can you make, like, in this stream or any person, in this, in this like community ever thinks about defending domestic abuse. Or anything like that. Or anything in that vein. Or anything that fucking serious. Alright? You have no place here. And I want you to unfollow and I want you to leave. Wow, we got a fucking I... hero over here. That Wow, what a profound statement. Now what? Thank you for that. Wow, what a fucking hero. You are coming into my chat and saying that my take is wrong. I would like you to go onto Twitter. And I would like you to read what, what Wilba said again. At the end of the day. If you make a statement or an attempt at an apology and all you begin it with is saying that you have changed that is not an apology go ahead spit it out and also the shit one no another person <laughs> decided to respond. sorry I, what's up are these guys idiots or what man there's all throw the whole youtube fucking minecraft community away man Except for that one girl, the one who got bit, man. Let's keep her, let's keep her, let's keep her safe, man. All right.